Inside 30 seconds to launch again, and Terry's chief engineer, Mike Dorsch, will uh, make most of the calls going uphill um, on the ascent uh, profile of Antares, uh, greatly anticipating the uh, delivery of Cygnus uh, to orbit and on its way to the International Space Station. Five, four, three, two, one. We have ignition. We have lift off of the Antares vehicle for the Orb 1 mission while the flight facility delivering signals on its first commercial mission by service to the ISS. And Antares is on its way, delivering uh, Cygnus to orbit. After launch, all uh, continuing to go smoothly in the initial stages of uh, ascent for Antares. We passed through 3,000 feet in altitude. Avionics power systems remain uh, nominal. Uh, pressurization valve VNO3 has come on. Core pressures are nominal. A modest amount of steering as the vehicle passes through max Q and its maximum dynamic pressure. Altitude is 45,000 feet. TVC steering remains good. Pressurization valve VNG3 is on, where pressures remain nominal. Attitude is good. Velocity is 2,000 feet per second. Avionic systems remain healthy. Engine performance remains nominal. Two minutes into flight. TVC still tracking commands well. Attitude remains nominal. 100 seconds to main engine cutoff. Altitude 100,000 feet. Attitude remains nominal. Coming up on uh, T plus two minutes and 30 seconds. Avionic systems remain good. TVC is tracking commands well. Uh, steering commands are very small at this point. Two and a half minutes into flight, uh, stage one throttle down will occur about three minutes, 24 seconds into the mission. Engine performance looks good. Coming up on T plus three minutes. At avionics power systems still look healthy. Three minutes into the flight. 100,000 feet altitude. Core pressurization valves of VNO 4, 5, and 6 are all on now. Core pressures remain nominal. Standing by for throttle down that will occur uh, at an altitude of 49 miles. Now 10,000 feet per second. Traveling uh, 7,200 miles per hour. Less than, less than 30 seconds to Miko. Altitude 300,000 feet. Attitude remains nominal. We've skewed. Miko's skew is complete. Standing by for main engine cutoff of stage one. Power nominal. And we have Miko. Attitude remains nominal. Miko occurring 66 miles in altitude, traveling 10,000 miles per hour. Stage one separation. And then, as you heard, stage one separation has occurred. And the uh, telemetry uh, tracking the spacecraft. A beautiful launch occurring on time at 1.07 p.m. Eastern Time.
Uh, stage one performance was 19,710 uh, delta v, feet per second of delta V. That's within 40 feet per second of the nominal prediction. Excellent stage one performance. Uh, Antares is now in the coast phase until the proper conditions for fairing separation and stage two ignition are achieved. And that fairing separation should occur uh, about 30 seconds from now, about five minutes, 20 seconds into the mission. Now at five minutes, MET and counting. It's determined that uh, uh, stage two addition will be at uh, T plus uh, five minutes and 47 seconds. So under 40 seconds to stage two ignition, attitude remains nominal. Standing by for fairing separation, followed uh, very quickly by interstage separation. Twenty seconds to stage two ignition. <laughs> 